Hello everybody, welcome back to Cure for the Common Game. Today, we are going to look at Journey to Nyx, my friendly local game store in Dyersburg, uh, the Collector's Connection. Got in a box of Journey to Nyx and said, you know what, I, of course we all probably watched Rudy's video anyway, and I, I had forgot about the possibility of God Packs. So I said, you know what, I'll blow a $20 bill. So... Six packs, let's see what I got. I didn't really buy much of this set back when it was standard legal. I, I don't really know why. But there are some things in here that are a mythic. You control target player during that player's next turn, exile this. Eight mana? I have never heard of this card. And I see why. I don't know that that's an eight mana effect. I really, really don't. Let's see what else we got here. I don't think there's any commons or uncommons that I'm absolutely looking for. Suit of the Starfish. That could be a thing. And everybody's... Uh, although, a lot of these uh, uh, bestow creatures, it seems like I look for them quite a bit when building, when building decks. Okay, so Swing and a Miss on Worst Fears. And we got Aegis of the Gods. But not bad, I guess. Oh, oh, this was back when we had just ad cards. Classic Minotaur. Nyx Fleece. Ram. That's a card. Okie dokie. I don't really have the the best streak going here, do I? Hey, it's not worth a lot, but I use it a lot, so I'll take it. Yep. I, I think the odds are, what is it, 20 over 600 packs? Whoa, there we go. That's a $10 bill. That's, you know, half my money right there. Yeah, yeah. And I have uh, zero mana confluences, so. Huh. What to do, what to do. I'll probably save this for a four or five color deal. Because it's, there's enough two color lands to to get us through a two or three color deck, I, I, I believe. Well, depending on to what the deck wants. Extinguish All Hope. It's another not expensive rare, but it's one that I use a ton. It's a, uh, it, it's a heck of a board wipe. I say a heck of a board wipe, not really. In the right scenario, it can be a one-sided board wipe if you're you know, running just enchantment creatures out to frame. But I use it a lot because it's readily available and I, I was picking these up in like quarter boxes and three for dollar boxes, stuff like that. So that's why I use them quite a bit is because I need mass quantities. <laughs> okay, this is our last one. See what we got here. Well, obviously not the God Pack. Come on, focus before I. Well, that's a. Really good camera there. With the edges. Hmm. Deicide. Well, 
it's a thing. The artwork is just spectacular there. Really, really is. It is done. Well, that is what we got for our journey to Nick's packs. No, no gods and, you know, no temples, but still pretty good stuff that I'll use, at least the rare wise. But I guess that's it for, for this day of 100 Days of Magic. Uh, I appreciate y'all watching and uh, y'all let me know what you think.